The Hamilton Beach Classic Stand Mixer has 6 speed setting plus a quick burst feature for added speed. However, there doesn't seem to be much difference between speed settings. The difference becomes less noticeable as you go higher on the settings. Click the link in the video description to see the latest price. This stand mixer can handle light to medium mixes like cake batter, eggs, cream or butter, easily. If you intend to use it to make cookies, I suggest you also get the straight wire beaters or the twisted wire beaters which are designed for thick batters and cookie dough. Cake or egg or cookie, volume matters. For small quantities like one egg or a cup of cream you have to shift to hand mixer because the volume will not reach the beaters enough to achieve proper mixing in stand mixer mode. This is a drawback if you keep your mixer set up on the stand, then you have to detach and reattach. Let's talk about bread dough. This is the trickiest and most difficult dough for mixers to handle for obvious reasons. This mixer comes with dough hooks and the manual says it can do one loaf. However, the dough hooks should not be used if using as a stand mixer, you have to switch to hand mixer. Perhaps, this is the reason why some users have luck with bread dough while others don't. This is not a set it, run it, forget it stand mixer. You can leave it for a while, but don't do another chore and come back to it and expect a perfect mixture. Fiercely, the bowl does not turn automatically. The consistency might make it turn or you have to give it a nudge once in a while. Secondly, for the beaters to reach the side of the bowl, you have to move the turntable by manipulating the shift and stir bowl lever on the side of the turntable. This is kind of tricky. You'd have to practice to perfect it. I'd rather just scrape the side of the bowl every now and then, well, I'm not known for patience. Click the link in the video description to see the latest price.